It's easier to destroy something to, than to repair it and keep it. I never would have dreamed I would have been here. It's the most beautiful spot to me, I think. Right on the edge of nature. Right on the edge of San Francisco. My name is Robert Tichetto, and I'm the owner and operator of the Camera Obscura in San Francisco. 12 is your change. Thank you. This way. See, this place makes people feel like children. You know, they come in here and they leave happy. It's magical. What I enjoy the most about here is when I'm in here seeing people's faces. Because I see their eyes get wide and they have a smile on their face and nobody's talking, they're just looking at the image. I grew up here. It was different than our parents threw us out of the door. So I was running around the whole area always. Ocean Beach, so Point Lobos, Lincoln Park. Playland was a, very special to us because we used to go over there all the time. So it was a lot of fun. The Camera Obscura was built in 1946. When they built this was to bring people to the area. And it's all good times. The Camera Obscura is very significant in history because it's the beginning of photography. And also it was used as a drawing instrument for the Renaissance artists. My father took it over in 1992 until he passed away. He used to just hang out in front here and, and I would just help him a little bit sitting in the booth there. My mom helped me during the lunch breaks, so she's come down here and, and work a couple hours every day. It's a tough business because you're dealing with the weather. Strong wind, harsh conditions, very cold sometimes and lots of flies. It's a family business, so you have to continue on for other members of the family. It's a little more pressure that way. And then maybe two or three hours, not even one person coming by. I know I have a lot of responsibility because so many people love it, so I have to you know, keep it going. As best I can, I just, you know, the situation here is a little tough sometimes. Those are the hardest days for me. Because it might be a beautiful outside and no people here, maybe only 10 people coming the whole day. Like you have a beautiful product and nobody's enjoying it because every minute is changing. It's not the same. We don't make much money on here because otherwise I would be able to hire some staff and stuff. I like a more personal touch better. Coming out and explain to people. So it's never boring for me. This job is never boring because it's always changing. The holograms were added on in the 1980s, just to give it a little extra light around the edges here. It's a city national landmark, a state landmark, and a national landmark. So the building is always going to be here. It's going to be here forever now. Everybody comes and tells me that they used to come here when they were a child. So it's all about memories. This is part of our family now, so you want to continue that. History is everything, I guess, because everything goes back in circles, so we have to understand it. We have to preserve it, because we're losing so many things now. <laughs>